Hello there, world of YouTube. This is me, Swimster Girl, coming to you with my July Plan With Me video. As you guys can see, we skipped the title page and went um, straight for our monthly overview setup. The theme for this month is Sailor Moon, and something I thought would make it kind of fun, a little bit more interesting, would be to um, color code the spreads in regards to the Sailor Scouts. So as you can see right now, I'm doing red for this title or for this like little month thing, which represents Sailor Mars. Yes, Sailor Mars. She's actually one of my favorite characters. I wanted to do the red first as like part of the first spread because it's just so bold. And I just feel like the month of July is so bold for some reason. I don't know. That's just what I'm thinking. Um, this time I did, I, I guess it's just called like a, let's just say a simple layout. I didn't draw out any calendars or anything of the sort. I just wrote down the numbers going down. And right next to the numbers, I put the dates. So depending on when it started, I believe the first, if I'm not mistaken. Actually, I don't know when the first was, but you know what? It just goes like that. So right now you guys are going to see me add in like Thursday, Saturday, Friday. Oh, I, oh, I guess you're right. What, what? But yeah, um, I wrote the days of the week in correspondence to the days of the month so that I kind of knew what was going on on what days. I did events and important dates. So important dates would be like birthdays. Events would be if there is like a party or a get together. Things are still kind of weird where I live at in regards to the coronavirus, so it's just kind of staying to small gatherings. What you guys see me do here is I'm laying out glitter washi. This is like a really pretty glitter washi. It's like so pretty in person. I can't even describe it. Uh, so I'm laying out three strips. There's no specific reason why I did three strips. It's just I thought it looked nice. And I was like, you know what, let's just do three. And as you can see here, this particular washi wasn't sticking very well. And my guess is just because um, since the backing is, you know, against the glitter, I'm pretty sure that a lot of the, um, you know, pasting power per se or the stickiness to them kind of, you know, dulls out over time of being over glitter. But, you know, they haven't fallen off yet and they haven't moved, which is good. The corner, I just added like a little picture that I found on the interwebs of the sailor scouts all together these are just the main ones as you guys know sailor moon venus uh, mars jupiter and Mer mercury oh, i almost didn't pronounce that right and in this particular month i just decided to do my july memories right next to the monthly overview just keeping it very simple i don't know if you guys have realized this but a lot of my spreads are kind of simple well, at least i think they're kind of simple in comparison to what I used to do uh, another thing I did keep this month was the time tracker I just use this to kind of track how many hours I work and how many hours I sleep so comparing amount of hours work to amount of hours slept just to kind of gauge how my um, I guess my moods affected my activity levels are affected just to kind of to track those I don't really go super into depth to like tracking down like how long was I eating? How long was I on social media? Because we all know that would be an embarrassing amount of time. Because sometimes we give up sleep for social media. And as you can see here, I don't know what I was thinking. I royally messed up right here. I was supposed to do like um, light colors is AM, dark colors is PM. But all I did was just get one of my older journals that has extra pages. Cut a little bit of it off and paste it in there. And you know, good as new right <laughs> on the left side I did the same thing I did with the calendar which is write out the days and then wrote out the corresponding days of the week next to it just so I kind of know if I don't try if I don't see myself at work why, why wasn't I at work did I call off days off a little bit of vacation here a little bit of vacation there I so that's basically that's what it is it's just so I can see like oh if I didn't work on Monday was it a scheduled day off was it a holiday that kind of thing it just helps me keep better track of how things are um, shaping up you know check wise to budget accordingly next to it I did habits and I don't know if you guys realize this but I did the time tracking in blue that's kind of more representative of sailor sailor of sailor mercury and I did habits in green for sailor Saturn 
on the habits I tracked of course habit tracker I made this one a little bit bigger because I'm tracking more things you know because I do so well keeping up with the other ones there's some things that I know that I completely never do every month so I just kind of took it off until I you know I'm a little bit more serious about doing them but hopefully you know at some point it clicks and it's like girl you gotta drink your water you gotta drink your water if you want that skin to be nice and clear but um yeah so sadly for me i'm just kind of still sticking to like the one i never make it to two liters which is so bad but one of these months i'm gonna hit it one of these months before the end of the year we're gonna do it we're gonna do it you guys heard it here first <laughs> at the bottom of that one i did a sleep and a step tracker i know it's gonna kind of seem a little redundant um having you know tracking my sleep schedule on the time log and tracking my sleep schedule here uh time log is just more to see from what hour to what hour i was sleeping the sleeping one right here is just so i have like a quick overview of how many hours i slept you know and that kind of sense is just more so i can have like a quick overview of bam i still i managed to actually sleep like you know eight hours today which is kind of very rare when i do uh, I did this in two, four, six, eight increments because I once in a blue moon get to sleep over eight hours, but usually it's anywhere from two to eight hours. Again, it just kind of varies on how many hours of work and that sort of thing. Uh, something new I included in this month is uh, steps in a day, and this is also going based off of like 4,000, 6,000, 8,000, 10,000 because i don't do anything less than four but i i do do more than ten thousand but that's usually on the days i work so i was like you know what we'll just keep it at ten thousand as a max and we'll go from there for the mood tracker i went with the moon pendant i believe it's called you know moon prism power if i'm wrong go ahead and correct me in the comments because you know gotta be safe out here ah uh, so i did this one for the mood tracker and then every little you know hexagonal or whatever shape you want to call it that i did here represents like a day uh for the colors of the moods i did again the five main ones the pink the red the blue the orange and like the yellow orange for venus so obviously since i'm using the moon prism pendant i did mood and pink for sailor moon and I usually don't do a bring them page, but in this case I decided to just so I can include Sailor Venus in a way. And I just go went ahead and pasted like this picture of the girls all together again. This is more of like the original wear that they kind of use when they transform. Something I didn't film this time, which is really, you know, kind of weird. Well, actually my camera was having a day of that day, but um, I didn't film me drawing them in. What you guys see me doing right now is actually just... Um, outlining um two lines or filling in with an acrylograph pen for those of you guys that don't know what an acrylograph pen is it is an archer and olive like paint pen it works really well easy to use easy comfort and this is where i input i am now an archer and olive affiliate so if you guys do decide to buy like either the notebook or the pen feel free to use the code swims to gal for 10 percent off i do receive a small commission at no extra cost to you but hey i get a small commission you save 10 percent. it's a win-win situation here but yeah going back to the actual spread after the acrylic paint dried i just went over with some like gold flex and i kind of was i was going for kind of like a moon galaxy theme it just didn't come out the way i thought it was going to come out but you know live and learn it's not bad i think it still came out nice but that was just the finishing touch to this actual notebook and that is actually all for this video thank you guys so much for joining me don't forget to like and subscribe if you'd like to see more see you guys in the next one